Hey everyone, welcome back. Starship activity has been heating up at Starbase ahead of Flight 3, and I'm here to catch you up on the latest developments. Yesterday, Starship S-28 took a trip from the orbital launch mount to the static fire test stand. This move suggests a static fire test might be imminent, especially after it was destacked from Booster 10 and the earlier aborted wet dress rehearsal. While stacking the ship so quickly after engine swaps was initially puzzling, it now seems like a strategic move. On the 16th, SpaceX aborted the full stack wet dress rehearsal after partially filling the locks and methane tanks on both stages of the rocket. We are almost in the final stage of the launch preparations for Flight 3. However, launch license details remain under wraps, but a potential road closure scheduled today hints at a possible test on S-28, likely a static fire test. While teams prepare for ship testing, Booster 10 was also destacked from the OLM, likely to make its way to the build site for final pre-flight checks. Meanwhile, the four Starbase's second Starship Tower segments transported from Florida have safely reached the port of Brownsville. These segments will contribute to the construction of a second Starship Tower at Starbase. We have other exciting news too. Intuitive Machines IM-1 mission, launched by a SpaceX Falcon 9, is progressing smoothly. The spacecraft is in excellent health and recently beamed back its first images, including a breathtaking view of Earth as a big blue marble. In another shot, we can see the Falcon 9 second stage, moments after separation. We wish the IM-1 team a successful landing on the moon. SpaceX's next mission, launching a high-throughput satellite HTS for Indonesia's Telkomsat, is scheduled for today, February 20th, at 3.11 p.m. Eastern Time from SLC-40 in Florida. This will be SpaceX's 16th launch of the year. Not to miss any launch or future SpaceX and Starship updates, smash the like and subscribe buttons. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.